Good afternoon, I'm Jeff. I'm a Sewer Tech Northwest. Today we're at property address 14032 Southwest Walnut Creek Way here in Tigard. We're located at the front of the home, right here in this area with the bushes off to the right of the garage. We have a three inch ABS clean out. This will be our point of access. I'm going to insert the camera and check the overall condition and serviceability of the sanitary sewer line. Currently have water running. Here we go. Transitions over to schedule 3034 PVC pipe here at 21 feet. And here at 57 feet, we have reached the main lateral. I'm going to let the line drain out here for a couple minutes before pulling back. I am seeing some grease build up in the line. I don't see any standing water or anything like that, like an underlying culprit that would cause that kind of debris build up, other than the fact that uh, grease will build up in just about any sewer line, no matter how well it functions. You really want to avoid putting that kind of stuff down the line. Now because it is in a few areas, rather thick, um, and I'll push back out here real quick and show that. I wanted to get through the PVC there look for standing water uh, but in a few spots here the grease is getting fairly thick it's about a, a half inch or more thick which can cause other debris to, to build up in the line like spots like this where I'm peeling it off the bottom of the pipe and it looks like it's probably a little bit of toilet paper too I do recommend jetting the line out the line is functioning uh, but that stuff can cause uh, debris to hang up on top of it. It doesn't mean you're going to just get a backup all of a sudden, but it would be a good idea to get it cleaned out of there and then avoid putting grease back down the line. I'm just about to pull the camera head out of the line. The line itself is in good shape and functioning at this time. Uh, I do recommend jetting the line just to remove the, uh, the grease buildup in there. Apart from that, the line's in great shape.